Hey there guys, how are you? Welcome back to another video. The football legend recently posted on his social media in an attempt to promote the new digital football platform. This new tech has very high hopes because Cristiano Ronaldo doesn't just promote any brand. Let's take a look at Cristiano Ronaldo endorses Singapore billionaire Peter Lim's digital football platform. But before we get into it, make sure to subscribe to our channel with notifications turned on so you don't miss out on any of our new videos. Let's get started! Number 4. Is Ronaldo the brand ambassador of the new platform? With the help of Manchester United's Cristiano Ronaldo, Zuju GP, co-founded by tycoon Peter Lim and his son Kiat Lim, has introduced its virtual soccer program. Last week, the Portuguese football star reminded his 356 million followers on Instagram that there was wonderful surprise ahead, and encouraged them to subscribe to at Zuju GP. In a statement posted Monday by Zuju GP, Ronaldo said, I am extremely thrilled to be affiliated to this fantastic relationship, especially with my buddy Peter Lim. I've known him for a long time, and being a part of this project with him makes me so pleased. And the fact that Eastern Region and Northern Region can finally join makes me even happier. Number 3. What's it all about? Zuju GP seeks to digitize the live entertainment experience for fans by offering amusement, social, and e-commerce opportunities, according to the company. Through its free software AI-based technology, it will also create an ecosystem of services, enabling teams to bring players, manage personnel, train and guide prospective athletes. Given that Asia is home to 60% of the planet's population and has a rapidly rising number of fans, the Singapore-based corporation sees Asia as the next soccer region after Europe and the United States. Merchandise and games from the Premier League. Kiat Lim 28 stated, The future of football is here, and it's digital. Zuju GP will be a technology-driven community that engages fans in a consistent and compelling manner while boosting football operational efficiencies. Valencia CF is owned by Kiat's father, Peter Lim, who is 68 years old. The elder Lim was placed number 15 on Singapore's 50 wealthiest ranking, which was announced in August, with a personal fortune of $2.6 billion. Lim, a trained financial advisor, has concentrated on real estate, healthcare, and sports since leaving palm oil giant Wilmar a decade ago. It includes medical operator Thompson Medical Center, as well as Premium Resort Hotel in Manchester's historic Northern Stock Exchange Tower. Number 2. How They Started Mr. Lim, 68, acquired Valencia, a Spanish team in 2014, and is also an investor in Salford City, an international team. Kiat, his 28-year-old son, had begun working on his own covert tech startup called ARC, a new form of the private social area, and he would frequently discuss it with his father. The coronavirus outbreak did a number on the football industry's revenues, and the Limbs decided it was time for a technological revolution. In his first press appearance, Kiat remarked of his father, it turned out that he had been thinking seriously about a remedy. They devised an ambitious concept to bring sports fans and pros together on a common network. They've spent the last year brainstorming and fine-tuning the concept, with plans to beta test it in the first half of 2022. Kiat added, I've never seen him so enthusiastic about a project. Zuju GP has a lot of potential. Zuju Gameplay will be an engaging network that allows fans to watch games together and interact in a fully functional ecosystem that spans the real and virtual worlds. It's called a football verse by the corporation, which is similar to the metaverse visions proposed by firms like Facebook and Epic Games. Zuju GP Exchange will be a recruiting platform that connects talent, professionals, and hiring clubs. Artificial intelligence will be used to power it, and blockchain technology will be used to protect it, according to the company. Zuju GP Rank will be a digital football academy that specializes in accomplishing goals and activities. The name Zuju is a pun on the word Tsutsu, which means to kick. Its origins can be traced back to Tsuju, an ancient Chinese game that is said to be the first recorded form of football. In Zuju GP commercial, Ronaldo, who has 356 million Instagram followers and 95 million Twitter followers, transforms into a Chinese warrior. Number 1. The Encounter with Coca-Cola Ronaldo has always been very picky about the brands that he supports. Earlier in the year, the now Manchester United star made headlines due to his encounter with Coca-Cola. Inadvertently, the Portugal captain stirred a global commotion by refusing to sip the famous soft drink in front of the press. 
Cristiano Ronaldo's dislike for Coca-Cola has been one of the most talked about topics at Euro 2020. But why has his behavior sparked so much debate? Ronaldo has been a standout performer at the European Championship, scoring three goals in Portugal's first two group games to put them in contention for a spot in the round of 16. However, the former Juventus star achievements on the field have been eclipsed by a now famous public display of scorn for one of the world's most popular companies. Before Portugal's play against Hungary, Ronaldo sat down for his first pre-match presser of the competition and noticed two Coca-Cola cans exactly in front of him. The 36-year-old quickly took the sugary beverages out of sight of the cameras and substituted them with a water bottle, rolling his eyes and muttering, Coca-Cola, with a disgusted attitude. Agua, Ronaldo stated as he held up his bottle of water before laying it down. The message was for people to drink water and avoid these drinks. Well, that's the end of today's video, guys. We hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, give this video a like. Also, check the two other videos on your screen if you like our content. We'll be back with another video soon, but until then, goodbye and take care!